Hellmaster EX brings unparalleled benefits to your boating experience, so it's important that you know how to access and use them. In this video, we'll cover the functions of the Single Engine Digital Electronic Control, or DEC. When you first press the power button, you see the remote light up with blue lights. This indicates that everything is ready to go. If there is an orange light on the remote, then the system has detected a problem. Check your gauge for a warning message and consult your owner's manual or your Yamaha dealer for assistance. Throttle and shifting are controlled just like a traditional remote. Pressing the lever forward or reverse to the first detent will put the engine into gear. Continuing past this point will begin to operate the throttle. On the upper left side of the lever is the power trim and tilt button. Pressing up and down will trim the motor in the corresponding direction. Just below the power trim and tilt button is the speed control button. You can use this button to fine tune your speed in 50 RPM increments. If your boat's equipped with either Hellmaster EX Autopilot or full maneuverability, it includes Yamaha's GPS receiver, allowing you to adjust it in 0.5 mile per hour increments if your boat speed is over 5 miles an hour and as little as 1 quarter mile an hour increments if your boat speed is below 5 miles an hour. The choice of using RPM or GPS speed increments can be changed through your Yamaha display. To activate speed control when underway, press the down speed control button. A beep will sound and an LED will light up. You can now adjust your speed a total of 10 increments up or down. If your boat has the full maneuverability components installed, you can also adjust your speed by bumping the joystick forward or reverse. An additional feature of speed control is called pattern shift. For when you are trolling in gear but do not want to have any throttle applied and you want to slow down even more. Activate speed control by pressing the speed control button. Additional presses of the down button will lower the engine's idle RPM to its minimum. Once the minimum RPM is reached, continuing to press down will engage pattern shift and the engine will automatically begin to shift in and out of gear. It will start at 90% in gear and 10% out of gear. Continuing to press down will increment this by 10% each time all the way till the engine is only 10% in gear and 90% out of gear. You will receive a notification on the display to let you know where you are. Using pattern shift can allow for extremely slow trolling speeds. And remember speed control also works in reverse. While an at gear trolling speed and when slower than normal reverse trolling speed using pattern shift. On the base of the unit, you have two buttons labeled station and neutral hold. On boats that have a second station, pressing the station button will allow you to assume control from that location. Make sure the main remote is in neutral. Then once you are at the second station, press station to take control from that position. The LED light will illuminate indicating that your station is currently active. When you are ready to regain control back at the main station, press the station button on that remote. The lit LED will indicate that station is now active. Pressing the neutral hold button will prevent a running engine from shifting into gear when the throttle lever is moved. This is especially helpful by allowing the motor to rev for additional charging if the boat's batteries are low. Neutral hold will stay active until the button is pressed a second time, which deactivates the function. In a separate video, we will cover how to set up trim assist for your boat and how to adjust the friction and detents on the levers. All of these great features are now part of the standard Yamaha Hellmaster EX DEC remote. But the system can be expanded even further with the addition of digital electric steering, allowing variable friction and lock-to-lock, -lock, autopilot, which makes navigating to your destination even easier, and full maneuverability which brings not only the simplicity of joystick control, but also the entire Yamaha Setpoint suite of features to enable boating control like never before.